Hello dear children, how are you today? Welcome to another fun learning with teacher Ira. Children, last time we had learned about the five kinds of plants. Do you still remember what are those? Wow, you are all amazing. Yes, we have tree, what else? Herbs, shrub, bulb, and Fine! Great job, children! You are all smart learners. This time, we will go into the five basic parts of a small plant. Children, these are basic, meaning most of the plants have this. Are you excited to find out what are those parts? Let us begin. The first one, children, is the... Ta -da! the roots you say roots these are roots you can find this right under the soil or under the ground and you know children what is the function of the roots yes they get water and minerals from the soil they are just right under the soil they are like straw that gets all the vitamins in there so let us put it here what do you call this again? Yes, roots. Okay, so let us slowly build our plant. Okay, now, right after the roots kids, just like what I told you, this will get all the waters and minerals from the soil, and this water and minerals need to go up. So, the next part will do that work. So, you call this stem. You call this stem. You say stem. So, let's put the stem here. Because the stem will carry all the vitamins and minerals that the roots got under here. The stem will carry them here. And the stem also holds the other parts of the plants. So the next parts that I'm going to show you kids are the ones that these stems are holding. This is what we call the leaf. If you have one, you just say leaf. But if you have many, you say leaves. So later we will have leaves. Kids, this is very important to the plant. You know why? This is where the photosynthesis happen. You know what is photosynthesis? That is the food processing of the plant because the plants make food for themselves through the help of sunlight, water, and air. So let us put the leaf here. And let me add some more leaves so that we would have leaves. Here is another leaf and then let's put some more here, over here. And then a leaf here. Yeah. Ah, so the plant gets better now. It looks better now, kids. Look at that. It looks so nice. Huh? Look at that. Wow. By the way, this is a tomato plant. Okay, have you seen tomatoes? This is a tomato plant. Hey, so what do we call them now? We call these leaves. Again, very good, leaves. Now, these are flowers. You say flowers. Yes, they are the most beautiful parts of the plant. So let me put the flowers here. Children, in some plants, these flowers is where the fruits begin. So right after the flowers, the fruits will come out. So you have a hint now of the next part. This is a fruit. You call this fruit. How do you call this? Yes, this is a tomato. So let us put it here. The fruit is the part of the plant that can be eaten, that's edible. You say edible. When you say edible, you can eat that. 
and also that is the part of the plant that contains seeds that would make another plant. So let us have a recap or a review of the different parts or basic parts of a small plant. Let us begin from down here. So what do you call this? Yes, you are correct. Roots. How about this part that carries all the water and minerals and holds the other parts of the plant? Correct, children. The stem. How about this part that make food for the plants? You are correct again. So we call these leaves. How about the most beautiful part of the plant? What do you call this? Absolutely right! These are called flowers. How about this part of the plant that you can eat and has seeds inside? Yes, the fruits. One more time. Roots, stem, leaves, flowers, and fruits. Great job, kids! So, I hope that you had learned something today. Please don't forget those basic parts of a small plant. Hope to see you next time. Thank you, children. Bye!